Good morning. I'm Brett and welcome to my backyard. This morning I'm out here revamping a flower bed. I had a large tree taken down yesterday. It was a little close to the house. You can see this oak tree here behind me. It was a little close to this oak tree here, which I would much prefer. And so it was kind of inhibiting the growth of it just a little bit. And so we wanted to get that one out of the way, uh, prevent damage to the house, let this oak tree here grow a little better and give us more room in this flower bed that we're gonna redo and get it nice and prepared for next spring. And so I wanna show you what I've done with it so far. What we've done is here's the tree we had taken down yesterday. You can see it's probably about two foot wide at the largest point of it. And what I did was went ahead and put some slits in it here. What I'm trying to do here is to help uh, get water down in there to help rot this stump out a little sooner and then I don't know about your area but here our city will pick up our limbs and things and mulch them for us and sometimes we're lucky enough to get some of it back and that's what I have around it here and what I'm going to also do to speed up the process plus to help the aesthetics of the flower bed is I'm going to take some of this mulch and we're just going to cover it over here and we'll get a good layer over the top of it kind of like we do in our other flower beds as a weed suppressor a nice thick layer of mulch will help this trunk here from trying to regrow plus it will help retain some of the moisture down inside to help rot that out faster and so this is kind of the the whole process of the tree coming to fruition here and this mulch will in turn eventually uh, rot down and make good soil here for us to be able to plant in. And here's just a quick look at the flower bed. Oh, you can see some of the sawdust from the cutting. I've scooped some of this up and uh, added it to the compost pile that I was showing y'all the other day. Uh, sawdust is a, another good thing. Uh, it'll break down really quickly and provide a lot of nutrients in there for it. But uh, all I've left is a, I've got another little tree I'm going to take down there and I've got my rose bush here and some four o'clocks that we're going to remove and get this little flower bed here all prepped up. If y'all haven't yet, uh, be sure and like and subscribe to my channel and leave me some comments of other videos you'd like to see in the future. Y'all have a good day.